A codicil is an add-on chapter. Yep. If you write a will and you decide at a later stage, I'd like to make a gift to my friend, I want to leave them a thousand pounds, you don't have to rewrite the whole will, you can leave the will as it is and a codicil says, this is an add-on chapter to my existing will. So a codicil is only for an existing will and that's when you can make the alterations. The most frequently chosen codicil subjects are an extra legacy or to say, I want to change my executors. Because there are a lot of people out there who have family executors, they've chosen their children, they've chosen their spouses. And one of the things I was saying before is if you go for professional executors, you don't have that problem for inheritance tax. And there are practical considerations as well. If you've got a spouse as your only executor and you die, the last thing your spouse wants to do as soon as you've died is to start dealing with the complicated paperwork of dealing with an estate. They want to be able to say, deal with it. Um, and that's what you can do with professional executors. Beneficiaries have the complete right to know all the ins and outs of the finances during the estate. The executors must give to beneficiaries a complete account of every penny in and every penny out. So they will see what's been spent and why, and they have plenty of legal chances and opportunities and rules to say they're allowed to question it or ask questions or have more details or see why certain decisions have been made. That's not a problem. But instead of lumbering a wife or children with that, you have carte blanche to, to do it.